It very well may be true that Virginia Democrat Governor Ralph Northam posed for a blackface photograph back in 1984 while he was in medical school. It also very well may be true that Lieutenant Governor Justin Fairfax committed acts of sexual violence back in the early 2000s. And it is true that Virginia Attorney General Mark Herring wore brown makeup and a wig back in 1980 to look like a black rapper at a party when he was 19 years old at the University of Virginia. Stories like these come to light all of the time. These just happen to be the ones topping our headlines today. And in the wake of this news, all three of these men from Virginia are facing a tsunami of calls to resign from their positions. This is a tricky puzzle. On one hand, our politicians, our leaders, they have a sense of duty. They're called to a higher standard, and they should maintain a higher standard of decorum. After all, our actions illustrate our character. On the other hand, all of these cases were well over 10 years ago. And not every action defines who we are. Some are just mere mistakes, a brief bad decision. So I ask you, should we let the past actions of our leaders condemn their political futures? You. Tell me.